Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can use Google Slides with Screencastify. So if you guys want to learn how to do it, just follow the steps that I'm going to show you. As you can see guys, I'm right now in Google Slides and this is how the homepage looks like. So firstly, we're going to enter a presentation. So right here, as you can see guys, you're going to find sort a new presentation. You can either source a blank presentation or you can choose from the templates right here. If you want to expand the template list, just go ahead and click on template gallery here at the top. And right now, as you can see, guys, the, the uh, list has been expanded. So just go ahead and click on the templates you want to work with. For example, I'm going to select this one. And right now, as you can see, guys, the template is loading. And now we are inside of the presentation. So once you're here on the presentation, you're going to find all of the tools that you will need to modify or to customize your presentation. Here in the top, you're going to find file, edit, view, insert. If you want to insert an image or an audio, you're going to find format, slide, arrange, tools, extensions, and lastly, help. So right now, in order to be able to use Screencastify with Google Slides, all you need to do, guys, is open new tab and then go ahead and type Google Chrome Web Store. Once you do that, go ahead and hit enter and then click on the first link. Once you're here, go to the search bar and then search for screen classify. And once you find it, go ahead and click on it. And then once you're here, go ahead and click on add to Chrome. Then click on add extension and right now if you check right here you're gonna find this downloaded so right now once you add it you can sign in to screencastify with your google account click on continue then click on allow and then just wait for it to load you need to answer these questions for example i'm going to choose education student continue continue and then choose what grade level are you in if you choose that you are uh, a student so i'm going to choose a random one click on continue then click on finish once you finish all of the steps and then just go back to google slides and then search for the extension right here go ahead and click on it and then as you can see guys, you can record from here. Just click on record and then you're good to go. So this is it guys for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.